tell you what, that water is a little cold. I just got splashed by a couple of big waves created from the tugboat back there. And uh, with the uh, cold wind that's blowing, because we're now into uh, mid to late October, it was a pretty chilly uh, spray. Anyway, I've got a great vessel for you right now. Uh, new for 2024. Oops, it's a pole steam. It's the one on the left. So having just completed a maiden voyage on the Great Lakes, uh, Paul Steam Lebesco is now making her way uh, back up to Montreal and then back out onto the ocean and beyond. And I'm sure we'll see her again next year, but I think this is the last time we'll see her this year. I can't see her again across the Atlantic and back in that time. So anyway, here she is. A very sharp looking bow on that. So as you can see from the shot, I'm still kind of back there. It's directly above uh, the stern of the ship. So the, the stern's gonna look nice. <laughs> Let's get that drone up. This is another brand new vessel from Polsteam, and this is the Polsteam Lebsco. Built in 2024 at the Shan Kuan uh, shipyard in China, uh, she is the third in a series of 12 new bolt carriers. Uh, she recently just embarked on her maiden voyage uh, where she departed from Charleston, United States and made her way up to the three rivers in Canada and then on to Sault Ste. Marie and now she's on her return journey on this particular video you're watching. Uh, so she's just completed her maiden voyage so she's making her way back out towards uh, Montreal right now as we're watching her heading into Port Coburn. This good looking vessel measures in at 199 meters long which is 652 feet and 8 inches and she has a beam of 23 meters and 70 centimeters which is 77 feet and 9 inches and her overall gross tonnage is 22,701. Polsteam often names its ships after Polish lakes, rivers or geographical features as a nod to the country's national heritage. This particular vessel is named after Lake Lebsko, uh, a large coastal lake in northern Poland near the town of Lieber. Lake Lebsko is part of the Slowinski National Park, which is known for its unique shifting sand dunes and biodiverse wetlands, and is one of the largest lakes in Poland. You can't get much closer than this to a ship when it's actually on the water. Well, the joys of a sea do. 
probably looks closer than what it actually is. I'm probably about 75 feet away from it. Right up against the wall here. Oh, the bridge is going up, so I'm gonna go ahead of it and uh, we'll shut the engines off and we'll hear it go by. It's actually going in pretty fast against that wall. Right, there you have it folks, Paul Steam, Lebsco, just here in Port Coburn, and then it's going to make its way down the Welland Canal, onto Lake Ontario, and up to Montreal, and then beyond. Hope you enjoyed the video, until the next one, stay safe, see you all very soon.